Just uh, wanted to take some pictures before my flower bed really got going good so I could see how it uh, progressed throughout the years. This is my first iris. Look how pretty it is. And there's another bud. And this is another one. I'm hoping this is going to be different, but I don't know. Okay, let me see if I can show you a bit of a overall view. Can I put the little uh, bricks down last year? And they really look nice. And there's Mr. Schmeagel. He's happy. <laughs> He's our adopted baby now. He was my son's dog, but uh, I think he's kind of adopted us. We love him. Okay, back to the flowers. Let's see. Here's some little Dusty Miller. Didn't know if I'd like them there or not, but they add a lot of light to the flower bed. There's our drip system. And I need to uh, get that all tested out and ready to go for the summer. And there's some little happy pansies. They've been uh, doing good since uh, spring weather has started uh, being warmer during the day. All right, let's move on. I don't want to make this too long. Okay, let's see. There's some more little pansies. No, that's not a pansy. That's a... Oh. That's a petunia. That's a double petunia. Look how pretty it is. Okay. There's some more petunias over there, I see. And that right there is going to be, uh, let's see, that's, um, it's got a blue spiky flower on it. Uh, I got it out of the front yard. I can't think of the name of it right at the moment. Oh, I know what it is. Milly Blue Sage. Okay, and that over there, I believe that may be some daisies of some sort. I'm not sure. And that little plant right there, which you can't hardly tell anything about it right now, but it's called a uh, frangy pangy, I believe. Okay, let's move on. This plant right here is going to be a really pretty bush. It's called a wajilia. I've never grown one of those before, but it's getting some new leaves, as you can see. Yeah, little dark, those little dark things. Let me get closer so I can see it. Ooh. Oh, those are pretty, aren't they? Oh, that's cool. It's gonna neat, be a neat plant. Okay, there's a different type of little pansy. And then this one here is a different type of pansy too. Just such a happy little flower. Okay. And then this is one of my plants I planted from seed last year. It's a cat, uh, see, cat ant, I believe is what it's called. I was so happy I got that going. It's a perennial and it'll come back every year. And that's what I'm looking for. This is more of a, kind of covers the ground, but it has these beautiful little uh, spiky flowers on it. Look at those. Man, those are pretty. Okay, let's move on. This is a little rose bush I planted last um, fall. And it's going to have a little, it's, it's more of a little um, small miniature type rose, and it's going to have a pretty little pink rose on it. I can see there's a bloom right there getting ready to open. Okay, the 
these pansies here are really pretty too. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to keep this camera from being so there you go. And these, I believe, yeah. These are flocks I planted from seed last year, but they didn't do too much last year. But look at them now. They're getting ready to bloom. Here's another little rose bush I planted last fall. And it looks like it's going to be a smaller rose too. But they're all doing really good. Can't wait to see them bust into bloom. Okay, here's some more of the uh, let's see what those are. Look at that bloom. Oh no, that's a weed bloom. <laughs> Sorry. Um, there, there's one. That's a red drum and flocks, I believe is the name of it. Again, those were from seed. And all of these here look like they're getting ready to bust into bloom. I don't know what those are. It almost looks like a Hmm. I don't know what that is. We'll have to wait until it blooms. And this little plant here, I thought it was dead because I'd moved it around a couple of times. And I can't remember the name of that either. It's got a pretty little, I believe that's just the color of the leaves on it. Yeah, okay. And then, let's see. This is a little weed, and they've got pretty little flowers on them, but they're getting a little bit invasive. I guess I better start pulling them up. Here is my red drum and flocks, and that's covering a pretty large area there, kind of around the rose bushes, as you can see. And these are my beautiful little rose bushes, and. Uh, Look at the leaves on those. The leaves are beautiful just as they are. And they got to get loading up with buds. And there's another one. That's my first rose bush that I bought. And it's a couple of years old, maybe three. I had it in a pot for a year. And those back there are my snapdragons. No, not snapdragons. Um, larkspurs. I planted those from seed in the fall. And look how beautiful they are. I'll have to do that again next year. Okay. And this is just a mess of hoses and stuff. I need to get my drip system set up again, as I said. I wanted to show the new little hydrangeas I got. Planted those in the fall. And I believe those are pinnacle hydrangeas. Which means that I can trim them back and uh, they'll still bloom. Anyhow, I'm excited to see what those look like. And that little bush right there, you can't even tell there's a bush there anymore. I don't know if that's going to come back or not, but I think that's um, some lantern. can't remember. Okay, let's walk over this way. There's my little lavender bushes. I don't know if those are going to come back or not. I'm not sure if I need to cut them back or what I need to do with them. Well, Schminkle, you need to move out of the way. <laughs> Okay, this is another little bush I just got planted. A little rose bush. I don't remember what color it is. We'll have to wait and see. And these are my um, little hollyhocks. They came from the seed that the original holly hollyhocks I planted there dropped. I grew those from seed last year. And I believe, if I'm not wrong, where are they at? I think, I think this right here are cone flowers. 
That's what the sign says. I'm pretty sure those are cone flowers coming back. I'm excited about that. And this plant right here, I don't know if it's going to come back or not. Let me see if it has any new growth on it. I can't tell. It's a kind of a mallow hibiscus on it. I don't know if that's part of it or not, but we'll have to wait and see. Anyhow, there's another picture of the larkspur. And we get moved around here. There's a little grass that I'm hoping will do good this year. I see a little green growth coming off them. And then over here is, let's see, it is right there. Uh, I don't know if that's weeds coming up or if it's something. We'll have to wait and see how much further along after that's further along. And again, this is some mealy blue sage. It's coming off, coming back really good. And some more of the nepeta. Nepeta? Nepeta. And I can't say that right. That's the little purple blooms on it right there. Mixed in with some of the mealy blue sage. There's another little gross bush. Now that I can see the tag on that one, it says Parfuma Bliss. It's supposed to be a really pretty rose. I took a hibiscus up that was planted right there because it was overshadowing my roses. Transplanted it. I don't know if it's going to grow or not in the new place. Okay. Some more of the catnip. And those are oxide daisies, I think. Yeah, some sort of daisy. There's my phlox. Those are getting ready to bust out and bloom. Look at that. See those little fuzzy looking things? All of that's going to be um, blooms. Well, that right there, I'm thinking that maybe. I don't know what that is for sure. It's something. I think something it might have reseeded from when I, I don't know what that is for sure, but it's pretty. And it had a tag, but I think it's, uh, okay, here it is. This is called Brown, nah, can't read it. Nature has taken over. Hmm. Okay, I don't know what that is, but we'll wait and see. I'll have to figure it out. Okay, there's some more plants that came back from last year. That's called a, uh, I think it's called a fringe plant. Look, I'm not on it. Right there, you can't hardly see it. Let's see. Let's see that right there? It's gonna have a beautiful uh, red fringy looking flower on it. Okay, and this right here is another one of my rose bushes. Look at the leaves on that thing. I mean, even if it didn't have a flower, the leaves are just beautiful. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know what the name of that one is. I'll have to make it on a bigger tag so I can see it. Okay, I think we're about done here. This one here, there's another one there. It's a small rose, I remember. Where's that? There it is. 
That's a smaller rose. Okay. Now, I think that one, I'm going to pause it.